Previously on No Limits. Going in to pull the flag and I roll my ankle. If coach finds out Taj got hurt playing powder puff, she's going to be furious. This is our gym, our home court, and we're not just gonna let these out of state teams come in here and beat us. Another 30 point win? We is not playing this year. I've been having a lot of conversations with God. Jada Williams just entered the transfer portal. Today is signing day, and I think I know where I'm going. So pretty much all the high schools in San Diego are here. Um, we're just going up as a school, announcing where we're going, and then signing our letters of intent. Good morning, everybody. Thank you very much for being here. We appreciate everyone coming out this morning. I love signing day because I got to see my teammates sign. You know, it just showed all their hard work has paid off. You're an elite group. There's 5% or less of student athletes that play sports across this nation that actually get the ability to take their athletic endeavors and academic endeavors to the next level. So again, a big congratulations to you. On stage, you know, I had to announce my little where I'm going. I'm Samantha Sokopong and I'm going to UC San Diego to play basketball. Yeah! I'm super happy for Samaya. She's going D1, UCSD, it's across the street. She's gonna be able to have her family at every game. And I just can't wait to see what she does at the next level. Once I found out Jada was having second thoughts about UCLA, I put on my number one recruiter in the country hat. to hit my gritty. <laughs>I chose Arizona because as a passionate player, you have to go somewhere where they're gonna let you be passionate. Coach Adia is the best coach in the country and she's a very passionate coach and she stands behind her players no matter what. And I'm the number one recruiter in the country, what can I say? I got Jada Williams to go to Arizona. That was me. And I'm playing with Brea, like come on now, like y'all not ready for us to play together for another four years. I signed, it's official, bear down. Here at Jada's signing day, she just signed the University of Arizona. Blessed to be a part of her journey and now it's time to get ready for her senior year. I think I've had a lot of conversations with God and my family and it's probably the best decision I've ever made and I'm super excited just to let the world know that we coming. It is a big day. You know, they work hard for four years to, to try to get to the next level. And to see them succeed and, and live their dreams, I feel blessed. I'm emotional. I'm so emotional. I'm so proud of her, excited, ready for the next phase. She gets to go with her, you know, best friend. It, it's a perfect fit. Not to mention, it's a good program. That's amazing that you both get to go together. Absolutely. Oh, what is it for you? You're staying close to home. Yes. Uh, why, how did you decide to, to do that? Well, I mean, it's just awesome to have my family close by. They can come watch my games whenever, just have their support whenever I need it. So I'm really happy with my decision. You know, Bray and Jada, they're obviously staying together in Arizona, so that's really cool for them. I'd say, ow, Brea. <laughs> what up? Brea, we're so proud of you. I'm just so happy to, that I was able to go with you on this ride, and I just can't wait to see what you're going to do in the future. I love you. Bear down, bear down. Bear down. <laughs> That's what make a scene is like this. No, 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 you can't, no, no. I don't no. get it. You do this. What does bear down mean? Bear down, I don't know. I don't really know what's next. You know, I just gotta figure out where I'm gonna go. Hopefully put a top five out soon, and then I'm gonna be in their position next year, and it's gonna be a great thing. You know, I didn't think I'd get here. Just like for me, Brea, the seniors, to see how far we've come is really awesome. Practice is important because it gives you preparation for the game and how, as a team, we're going to play defensively, what we want to do on offense. So it just prepares you. All right, make the circle a little bigger so we got it. First, congratulations. That was awesome today to have our seniors sign. We got three Division Ones. Let's clap it up. Woo! Woo! Hype it up! Woo! Hype it up! All right, did you text your buddy? Do you know where she's at? Brea is late to practice again. You know where she's at? I, I no idea? I okay. 
Then she had to take somebody to the airport. She what? Then she had to take somebody to the airport. I was asleep. She was like, where's Brent? We was like, uh-huh. But she had to take somebody up from the airport. Oh, she couldn't text her coach? I have no idea. Okay. So I'm looking at her location, she's still at home. So I call, I'm like, bro, bro, where you at? I woke up to a call from Jada and that's, and the rest is history. Like, happens to the best of them. She would really sleep because Bray can sleep anywhere. Today we're gonna focus on zone. We'll do some zone breakdown. We'll do zone offense. And then we're gonna put in our one three one three quarter court trap. So um, should be fun, a lot of energy today in practice. Let's have fun, let's get it. Hey, Taj Flash from that area. Who saw her cut? You wanna say something? It's me, it's me, it's me, it's me, it's me. Yeah, by yourself, Taj. All right, we got push out. What are the four objectives that we're gonna do every day? Five feet up. Uh, all right, what else? Lock in, 1% better, and push each other. Okay, tell me our core covenants. Tell me about the core covenants. Oh, what are our core covenants? Isn't it fresh? Fresh, yeah. Fresh? Okay. Family. Family relentless. Can you tell me about the core covenants? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I don't even know what uh, they are. Oh, I'm not even gonna lie, I forgot. What is it, fresh? Relentless, effort, effort. strength, humble. humble. Okay, fresh. Every day we gotta say it, what fresh is, what it actually mean, and then we gotta live it. I was coaching a football, y'all not know it. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> not good. <laughs> When I got there, I put my shoes on, and... Then we have Dragon, that's an easy one. Hey, can I make you tape? No, I was trying to get into practice. Okay, so get tape, because that's the last thing we need, is a, is a sprained ankle, okay? So when she got the practice, she didn't have her tape on, so she had to hit the road and walk to the football field. So I went up to get taped, Low key, the football field is kind of far, so it's kind of like a walk of shame when you know you already late, you already got to run, you let the team down, and you got to go get taped, so it's like a bad walk of shame. And I had to find the trainer, and when I told her I was late, like, she wasn't surprised I'm always late, so she taped my ankles and I went back to practice. It's important that every member of the team understands what a leader is. Yeah, I think Brea doesn't realize how much power she has on our team, but Brea is definitely a leader whether she knows it or not. I know I have to get better at being on time to things, especially since I'm gonna be going to Arizona in the next few months, and they're gonna be more strict on things like that. Good pass, Bray! Ah! Every day we come and practice, we're not gonna get this day back. And you, you think it's silly, but like, anything could happen, right? So when you come in here, like bring it and enjoy it. We, we got this amazing group, great personalities, you know, young kids willing to learn. We, we have. Good, great team chemistry, coaches that care. So let's just, every day, get that 1% better. 1% better, 1% better, okay? okay? Three, two, one. <laughs> Tori's on three, family on six. One, two, three, Tori. One, five, six, six, family. This is semifinals. We're in it, we're in the championship, okay? Straight ball, that's a great way to start the game. I'm feeling good. good start. Let's go. My mindset going into this game was win like always. If I gotta score, I gotta score. If I gotta pass, I gotta pass. Yeah, good job. If Jada keeps playing like this, we're gonna have a really good chance of winning that national championship at Arizona. It's only the first quarter. Naomi went down. What is it, Nay? What, what is it? What is it? Your knee? Huh? Yeah, yeah. Your knee? When Naomi went down, it was a really big blow for the team. You guys, somebody get up and let her sit down. 
Once I seen the tears coming from her eyes, I knew she was hurt. And so it kind of made all of us a little scared and a little nervous. Quick prayer for her. Naomi is a starter and she went down, so we had to make an adjustment and get somebody off the bench. And you know, one of the freshmen had to step up. Fia is Samaya's little sister. That's the R6 man that usually comes in for one of us guards. And so we know that she knows what she's doing when she comes in the game, but she's still a freshman, so we try to teach her. Fia came in and she started playing well. When Jada's in her bag offensively, you know it's gonna be a show. And when Naomi out, she had to turn up. With Naomi out, I knew I had to put on the show. Jay's probably the most passionate player on our team. She is very aggressive. Her moves got better, her shot got better, her court vision got better. She was really killing. She started going off. We're up 34 to 19 at halftime. We're down one, right? Naomi's knee is bothering her. So she's icing up and she's not gonna play this game. Okay, so now when we're going down the bench, it's your turn. When you get in the game, you gotta know the plays. Cross, we couldn't do it. We turned it over. Like that can't happen, okay? So this is your test. So you got it. When you get in there, you gotta prove it that you, you got it, okay? Because we're trying to win this and get to the championship. And you don't wanna let your teammates down because you can't remember a play, right? We're gonna go and punch them in the face. You understand? We're gonna go out there like we're down 20. We gotta finish it out for Nay and just pray and hope that she's back tomorrow. We're just gonna try and battle back and win this for Nay. The best part about our team is we're all versatile. At any given moment, somebody can go off and just get in their bag. Bray can go off for 25, I can go off for 25, Samaya can go off for 25. More than that, it's just winning, you know? This is their last high school season, so they want to go out with a bang. Girls are definitely really feisty, so it gets really physical out there. People don't really know, but girls basketball can get really rowdy. Yeah. Especially as a guard, like, they be physical. We're just being physical and playing the game. Oh, oh damn, girl. <laughs> Ooh, good job, Jay. This is like a heavyweight fight. Yeah, Samaya's home is definitely on the floor. Samaya falls on the floor, I kid you not, all the time. Everybody flops just a little bit. You got to when you get to the rack, you gotta get your calls, but Samaya did be flopping when you tell telling her all the time. I think Samaya averages about six, maybe even seven falls a game. Yeah. 68-38, final score. That's four 30-point wins in a row. We on something for real. You know, we had to come in. We had to finish the business, go to the championship tomorrow. Everybody on our team has their game. Like, Todd's been balling. So everybody's ha having their quarter, having their half where they ball out. So I think all the pieces are coming together. Just hopefully Naomi gets back right because we kind of need her for the season. So we're just keeping prayers up for Naomi, and we're, we're back on the, on the game tomorrow. It was a great win tonight. That Valley Vista is a really good team. Such fun basketball. It was fun that everyone got to play. Everyone contributed. So we're moving on to championship game tomorrow. Excited? It's game day, but it's also a very important day to Samaya. It's her birthday, and we have a surprise plan after our game. She has no idea what's happening, so it should be fun. Do I have to, actually? Yes, you do. We got our pinata. She had tacos. It was fun. On the next No Limit. We trying to get Aki and Big this season. If we're gonna cheat on a rep, what are you gonna do when you're in the game? If you're gonna quit in here, you're gonna quit in there. 
It's a championship game. We get to turn the big court this time. They have no answer for Brea. Nobody really does. We're headed back to Arizona and we're doing Secret Santa. <laughs> Yo fam, Overtime refuses to miss this year. The drops are non-stop, and we're just getting started. Get like me, and cop all the fits. All you gotta do is click the link below, and make sure you stay looking out for all our drops.